everyone today in this video we are going to talk about how to update Dell docking station firmware docking station firmware upgrade how to update Dell docking station firmware on windows visit the Dell support website search for docking station model download the appropriate firmware update tool connect your Dell docking station to your computer using USB C or Thunderbolt cable Open Downloaded Update Tool in Administrative Mode. Right click the tool and select Run as Administrator. Wait for the tool to gather all necessary information. Once the information is loaded, you will see Update and Exist button appeared in the top right corner. Click the Update button to start the firmware update process. Wait for the update to complete a progress bar with indicate the status of the update. The update status will be displayed above the payload information. Once the update is finished, you may need to restart your computer to apply the changes. On Linux, ensure you have FW up version 1.2.5 or later installed on your system. Download the Linux firmware update tool, example WD19 firmware update Linux xx.yy.zz.bind. From the Dell support website, open a terminal application on your Linux system. Change the permission on the download binary to make it exhaustible. A sudo change mode plus xwd19 firmware update Linux xx.yy.zz.bin. Execute the update tool with the install argument sudo wd19 firmware update Linux xx.yy.zz bin installed if promoter risks any kernel dependency package has needed unplug the USB C cable from the dock and reconnect it after one minute change that firmware has been upgraded properly sudo wd19 firmware update linux xx.yy.zz bin get device on Chrome OS, firmware updates will be included with the latest Enterprise Chromeware OS release. To check the firmware version, open a Chrome browser and navigate to Chrome system. Ensure that your Chromebook is running the latest version of Chrome OS, which will automatically include the latest firmware for the docking station. So, all URL are mentioned in the description box. It will be useful for you. Thanks for watching.